Hello, good evening, and welcome. Hello, good evening, and welcome to the stream. Yes, indeed. Uh, well, audio is working. Transcoding's working as well. Fabulous stuff. Right time, I think, for a bit of social mediaing. Yes, indeed. Right, I'm going to do a bit on the Discord. Nicely there. Someone just buffed me with something. It really. Oh, improved cut red tape. Nice. Right, and then I'll do the book face, which has gone weird again. They've changed it again for no good reason. Just to make life more difficult. Why? Every time I come to my own page on the thing, it says review now. Okay. Okay. Right. But it doesn't give me the option to post to the other place as well. So I have to go do it manually, which just takes longer. <laughs> Can you tell I hate Facebook? I really do. I, I do not like it. Um, Bookface can do one for all I care. Right, let's go to the live screen. Yes, indeed. Let's see now. Oh, yes. We're all good and we're all here. Let's grab some dailies. So if you watched the last stream, and some of you may have and some of you may not have, uh, we managed to hit level 100. Yay. Did I get a perk at 100? Did I spend the perk at 100? I wanted that, but that's 120. That's totemic right, so... Where did I spend it? Did I? Oh, I did Acrobat 3. Right, okay. Makes sense. So I'm wondering at this point... It won't offer me... Do I do a quick and easy... Biomare run? Because I can. Kind of deal. Or... Do we... Yeah, I'm not sure. See, if I do a biome run... I will definitely have hit... Thing, where... Where can you offer me? Crypto... Bell. See, the one after 100 is the Smuggler's Den, isn't it? That's going to be much more interesting as far as challenge goes. So I'm going to do the first daily anyway. Slavic, welcome uh, to the stream. Good to see you. Yeah, I think we should. I think that's the way we should do it. Hit, hit 101. And then pull the next mission. That's going to be the way. Uh, probably get buffs as well. Yeah, I think some of these buffs will run out. Okay. Hogerman, welcome to the stream. How the devil are you? Right, um, MP then. I'll just give myself composite infusers, I think. That should do. You're leveling going quick. Yeah, well, last time what I did was only play the tune when I was streaming, and I kind of missed the game. <laughs> because I wasn't, I wasn't streaming as often as I could play, so... Uh, this time I've kind of gone, no, I'm going to, you know, log in, do my dailies and whatnot. 
And also, Mrs. Kellis too has uh, reactivated her older couch. And currently, she's just playing lobies and sort of relearning the game. But yeah. She's all well and good. <laughs> no point me buffing you. <laughs> You're already on an MP. I was about to buff you then and go, here, have this. Do not need. Yes, my, uh, my... What were you trying to buff me with? I've just given myself infuses, so I'm not sure what you were trying to buff me with. Comp moochies. Can't have comp moochums on a level 100. On your MP, he's already running the 8 hour one. <laughs> With thanks. Right, can I? Okay. So my piercing buff. I haven't spent much of the IP, so I need 491 Psycho Mod 531. I'm awfully low. I think I had single moochums, maybe. Oh no, other way around. All right, so Psycho Mod five three one. And sends him four nine one. No, I'll be fine, I'll be fine. I just want to be able to self-cast the buffs I've got now. Because we just leveled so fast. Doing, you know, all the all the quests in Elysium. Yeah, that's going to do. And I should give myself a fresh hack and quack. That's going to be easy. Got the fruit fixer ready and geared to go. NCU and everything else, I think. Oh, you filthy subject of Charles the Third of his name, King of the Four Kings. No, Andrew will never, never become king. I've been asked that by so many American people. It's like, no, <laughs> that's not how succession works. Plus, he's been stripped of all titles. Uh, so, definitely no. Too early. What, the day after? Yeah, do you think? Maybe? Ten days of mourning.
You don't know about that. Well, maybe don't talk about it then. Um, yeah, there's an official 10 days of, of mourning. But we're not here for that. We're here for some anarchy online. If you're not the real Slim Shady, shouldn't you be sitting down? <laughs> well, I am. <laughs> I've got a sit-stand desk, you know. Can't afford none of that malarkey. Right, uh, a bit of RRFE, just to ease ourselves along. So that's going to be a bump log. You're not a fan of the Royals, well, that's entirely your prerogative, but I wouldn't say I was a Royalist, but I did like the, I did like the Queen. She was a nice lady. The character, well he is that, what do you want? What do you want? <laughs> Yeah, her, her I liked. Most of the people that don't like the royals know very little about them. Uh, think that they're paid for by the, the taxpayer, which they're not. All kinds of weirdness. Pathetic Wolf is raiding with a party of 76. Thank you very, very much. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Spam! <laughs> oh, thank you. You're very kind, sir. I do appreciate it. Shout out, Pathetic Wolf! Yes, the name is last seen playing Dark Souls 3, from which there is no return. <laughs> hello, hello! That's very kind of you. And to everybody on pathetic wolf's stream hello yes hello old welsh person in a padded room <laughs> they're coming to take me away away um yeah uh, i stream 99 percent this game which is anarchy online it's a, a mmo from 2001 which is still running it's a fantastic game very very complex uh so i'm not even going to try and explain it on stream Zeti was like, thank you for the follows. You're very kind, yes. So, um, yes, I'm about to do some regular daily missions. These are all other people. Well, mostly other people. That's a serious audio setter. It's a dynamic mic, you see. No room echo. The acoustic foam of doom. Yes. Um, a couple of ring lights and things, that's it, really. And then old fart in the middle. So, yeah, it all works. <laughs> the all the hardware i don't have um like vsts i used to use them but now everything's hardware i've got the dbx mic and xlr uh dbx um 286 mic pre uh and then this and it all sounds very sort of comfortable and radio so quite happy with it <laughs> Callow stream is a great way to learn the game thank you savik right what was uh oh we got place the bomber that's a, an alien mission. We're going to run and do that. Uh, this is the character I'm playing right now. As you can see, he is a bit of a sexy beast. So you, you may need to, you know, look away. Because, um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a very nice, well wound sound. Yeah, dynamic microphones. Uh, you need to be a little bit closer to them. But um, they don't pick up any background now. So I've got a mechanical keyboard and you can barely hear it, even though it's like, what, 16 inches away? Um, it's just how they work. They don't pick up if I move away very well, though. I've got the foam on it, um, but if you're talking above it, all the p p p is over there and not into the mic. Hence the expression, point the mic at your mouth, not your mouth at the mic. So, anyway. <laughs> We can have a chat about that another day. 
Hogaman plus the one plus the, uh, the, yeah, yeah, I have a mechanical keyboard and you can probably hear it all the way to Wales. Is that what that clicking I can... I wondered, you know, Sav, I, I thought, is that that? It's you, is it? I can hear it from Denmark. Could you shut the curtains in your living room and then maybe keep the noise down? That we can with all the, all the emotes. Yeah, Pathetic Wolf has has loads of the best emotes. He's, he's done, like, loads with just taking pictures of his... Fa I mean, look. Look, uh, these are my favourite ones. So just, how good are they? That's what I should do, but I'm just too lazy to make an animated <laughs> thing like that. <laughs> All mine are just, like, text and, like, one picture. Oh, dear. I am. I'm a lazy fool. I know, I know, but all mine would look the same. It's the beard, you see. If you've got a beard, all the, all the emotes would look... The guy with beard. Ah. Right, so we're now on board an alien ship. Uh, Anarchy Online is based... How many thousand years in the future? It's a science fiction MMO, but it does have some fantasy aspects to it. David Kin, yes, very welcome. Yeah, I'm sorry the chat is follower only, it's um, just to avoid spammers. 27,500 years in the future, that was it, yeah. Long time from now, yes indeed. Um, uh, the, the setting, it would, you know, it's like, oh, what's Lord of the Rings about? Well, you know what I mean, it, it, there's a lot <laughs> to get into, so basically the, the, the top down is it's an, uh, a science fiction MMO, predominantly. Uh, with a lot of roleplay. Um, there's no kind of like, the only build is a meta build kind of thing. You can pretty much make anything you want. In fact, most of these streams are me going against the grain and making builds that shouldn't really work, but we make them work anyway. You know, just through understanding game mechanics and, and equipment and all the rest of it. So. Um, yeah, I mean, I love the game, and that's why I've been playing it as long as I have. I have tried all the other MMOs I have, and the newer they are, the less I seem to like them, is the truth. They get less and less game... They're less and less gamey. Uh, more and more casino game. If you, I don't know if that makes sense. They feel like, um, yeah, a slot machine, more than, you know, something that you apply yourself to. But yeah, it's still surprisingly busy in the game. There's a um, brilliant, brilliant community uh, of people from all walks of life. Lots of the, a lot of older people, actually, because, well, let's face it, when, when I started playing this game, uh, I was 32. I'm <laughs> now 53. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? There's like, uh, there's a bunch of people that when they started playing were in university or college and now are, you know, in their forties, mortgage, two jobs, kids, you know, life, life goes on, life goes on. So yeah, I mean, there are instances of people that exist in the world today that would not exist if their parents hadn't met in this game. I'm, I'm, that might sound crazy, but it's absolutely true. Or in their sixties, says Sigs. Are you older than me, Six? <laughs> that surprises me. I thought I truly was the old man of AO. This also works in reverse. The muds that came out before graphical MMOs are even better than AO. Fair. Yeah, fair. I'll, I'll take that. But, you know, <laughs> I am indeed, mate. <laughs> Two old farts playing an, even, an, an old MMO pretending we're like how do you do my fellow kids yeah so yeah i i, I don't stream as a job I, I don't make youtube content as a job i do it purely for well kind of pleasure it's kind of a hobby thing as well but also to inform people six thank you very much for the resub five months thank you dude ellie barrel you have a wonderful voice well thank you very much that's very very kind of you thank you um I just think I sound like me, which to me is like, because nah. <laughs> it's me, you know, <laughs> this, this is the voice I normally hear when I'm making a noise. So, yeah. 
Uh, if my accent confuses you, that's fine. I am Welsh, um, but I've lived all over. I've lived, lived and worked in Liverpool, Manchester, London, etc. I've been to Europe. So what kind of happens is your, your accent drifts, plus my wife is from Lancashire with quite a strong accent. Um, so her, her speak, you know, a lot of her expressions and stuff, I, I come out with without even thinking about it. So, yeah, it's probably a, my accent is probably unique to me at this point. I think I think generally that is what happens with people. But thank you, that's a very very kind thing to say. You sound more northern than Welsh. It depends what I'm saying. I've, I've been told now and again I'll I'll go. Oh yeah, yes, he mawr. Now suddenly, and every sentence after that point, suddenly all my R's are rolling. Um, you don't have a regional accent. No, I, I try and sound as English as I can, whether or not that I, I, I pull that off. I don't know. Uh, I've got another perk. We're going into... Oh, yeah, the skill system is enormous. You've got uh, your base ability, so... And these all bleed into other skills. I should spend some in here. Uh, they bleed into a bunch of other skills which have a different cost depending on your class. Um, which is what makes certain builds very difficult because, um, you know, the, to the, like the green is the cheapest to spend IP on uh, versus like if I went to try and do ranged weapons, everything's dark blue, which is very expensive. So that's the basic skill system. You've got your, your body and defense, melee or ranged. Then you've got spell skills, I suppose you'd call them in anything else, called nano skills in Anarchy Online. Uh, then movement. Uh, so how fast do you actually run? There is a cap, so you can't end up like <laughs> freight train whizzing along like a jet fighter. Um, and then uh, combat and he uh, healing is actually more about um, how well you can equip things. So your first equipment layer is sort of weapons, HUDs. To, so these are called NCU. The more of them you've got, the more spells you can have cast on you, or nano programs as they're called there. Salvo, subscribe to Tier 1 for 21 months. Wow. Salvo, thank you very much for the uh, the resub, and thank you for the 21 months, man. You're nuts, but I love you. <laughs> thank you very, very much. Uh, so, yeah, I've got these in. Uh, then you get HUD items as well. I'm trying to go as quickly as possible, but give you information. Then you've got physical armour that you're wearing, which not only gives you protection, but can also have stats in it that buff some of the skills we were talking about earlier then your character has implants or in the case of this one because it's a shade has a different slightly different system called spirits where we don't need treatment to equip them and then the social tab where the fun stuff you know so you can look like whatever you want whereas you know when non rama matches but the stats are great that mean was he the guy with the horse head inside a coffee table kind of yeah that that um but then you can put whatever social items you want on and look whichever way you want. So Transmorg is, is a thing. Uh, then on top of that, you've got a perk system. So it's more skill points, but you get like one every 10 levels until you hit 200, and then you get one for every shadow level. Then you've got research. Uh, <laughs> it's like, stop now, there's too much going on. So what happens over 21 years, you get another expansion and, and you know, power creep. So you've got all these other skills... 10 lines in each that are unique to the class that you play and um, one universal one called apotheosis uh which kind of really finishes your character out and it's fun getting there there's thousands of different um encounters bosses missions areas to explore uh so yeah we're going to one of some different area now where's the hell's this on oh, foggy hill that is miles away i'm just looking on this big world map here let's see right there center on mission this is a custom map made by savik in the chat the best map of rubicar in the world so yes it is rather good Vesali's tower oh right so pleasant meadows fix a grid it's going to be the quickest isn't it or shall i fly there we'll fly so we can look at some of the world for the the new people in the chat will go uh, to HO and fly the rest of the way. 
and Larry, congrats. <laughs> cool. Yeah, so, um, yeah. Well, I think you, yeah, first, you were one of the first uh, subscribers. Were you the very first subscriber, Salvo? Or you one of the, is it the first 15 get the one, the, the first badge? Or what have you? I'm not sure. Uh, what I'm doing now is called rubber banding, and it means there's some lag on the server. <laughs> you are the very first. Oh, Salvo has the honour of being the very first subscriber. Yeah, I mean, I I made a Twitch account a few years ago, um, and I did try and do a stream like once, like I don't know, 2017 or something like that. But it wasn't until I think. 27 uh, 2019 that i actually tried one more i think i did two in the whole of uh, 2019 and then when we hit lockdowns and on all the rest of it in you know 2020 then i just started streaming more and more often and here we are uh faffing around doing this <laughs> still still playing this game um but i do love it now and again i'll i'll stream something different for a bit of variety so i i did stream cyberpunk when it launched um done fallout skyrim yeah a few others oh control that was a good one um oh alien isolation yeah scaring myself silly with that why did i run here i'm in the right playfield huh? i was running to the grid then thinking of is it not here am i i've come to the wrong spot haven't i uh see talking and talking and doing you won't crash the car but you might not end up where you're meant to go you yeah? know i'm in combat oh. <laughs> running away from enemy guards insane 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 welcome to the stream good to see you welcome on in did you come along with um with PW's crowd? We were in the raid. Welcome on in anyway. And if not, welcome anyway. Savic as in the AO map creator. Yes, she is here. That's Savic. And Savic is the boss. If Savic says something, that is what happens. Ways, so this is where the cool kids hang out. Kids, a bit of a stretch in my instance, but yeah, I think I know what you mean. So I've come to the wrong place, haven't I? Or is it mutant domain? They changed all the names on the Wampers and I've forgotten where. Except when Mihalik says so, then that's what happened. Yes, usually. Oh my god, where have I gone? I'm in mutant domain. Where's this mission? Pleasant Meadows. Oh, 20k I needed to go to. Never mind. It's not 2HO. God, I'm a doofus. This is this is one of the clan side cities. And all sorts of NPCs you could talk to around here doing all kinds of fascinating things. Yes indeed. Right. Twenty K is where we're supposed to go. 20k is... That's not a neutral Wampa Link, is it? Since when? No, it's on, it's on the Omni one. So I was right. Oh, I should have got... Southern Artery Valley, then 20k, yeah. Yeah, I really should have got the fixer grid, shouldn't I? 
there's me going, oh, there's some people that don't know Anarchy Online. I'll, I'll take a scenic route so they get to see everywhere. And so far, what they've watched is silly old man getting lost and going in the wrong direction. Man, great impression there, aren't I? <laughs> it's a neutral place in Omni territory. Hmm. I get you. I get you. <laughs> Newland is the place the cool kids hang out. Which, oh yes, I'm such a numpty. I've made this run a thousand times. And then suddenly, you know, a few new people in chat and I'm trying to go, oh, th this is my favourite thing in the world. Let me explain it to you. And just... <clears throat> come, I've come this way a thousand times doing um, the high-level prisoner mission. Derp, 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 derp. Yep, that would be me. And relax as we fly across the countryside. You see how painfully accurate Savick's map of Rubicar is. You put a splodge in random places saying Carl 2 getting lost. Zeta, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the follow. That stash is something else. This, this little thing. It, I shaved it all down, you know. It was... <laughs> It was actually a bigger beard than this. The beard was somewhere down. It was about there, wasn't it? Is that am I? It was touching my chest, anyway. Bullfrozer, welcome to the stream. Grandpa rambling about the old times and getting lost along the way. It happens, yeah. Did Grandpa take you to school? Well, we were going past some shops and he was telling me about what shops used to be there when he was a boy and we just turned up at church. That sounds about right. Oh yes, and we have flying vehicles in the game. Which my character is now flying. It's quite slimming on him really, isn't it, this this flying vehicle? <laughs> in the church you mean the pub. In my case it would have been, yeah. Where it may. Yeah, the beard was sort of down here, but I was complete, you know, Viking Santa. Um, they just they look they look great when they're all brushed and you pose for a picture. But then the reality of living with um, a beard like that is it's like having long hair. If you've got really long hair, and I had hair I could sit on at one point, ninety nine percent of the time you've just got it tied up out of the way. And with the beard, it's constantly in the way. And if the wind blows, it goes in all directions, and and you just look like you crawled out of a skip, like or oh, what's that American version dumpster. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> cool as they are yeah if you've got time to you know fuss and faff around with them <laughs> less santa and more stone age shaman is it shaman or shaman do you know what? whichever one you think it is, is is right um okay someone here is doing the same mission gun blast the beetle Right. Tomato, tomato. Yes, tomato, tomato. So I've got to wait for this guy to finish and then I can grab the mission as well. You're killing the wrong one. That's the one you meant to save. We could be here a long time if you're doing the mission wrong. Actually, I think the circle will reset if I run out of range. Kick, kick it, Zar, clan side XP. Don't know. Don't care. 12.45. I mean, what am I at now? Uh, 
Uh, 210%. So I, I don't... Doesn't really... <laughs> doesn't really register. It hovers around between 10 and 16 usually. My mission's not going to start while you're hanging around. Go away, blicks. So my mission spawns. Whichever side doesn't feel shame in using exploits to take sites that are... Yeah, that's usually it. This is this is why I, I, I went away from... It. The, P, the player v player thing in the game just got so toxic after a while that I just... It's optional. You're not forced into it, so I just walked away from it. Simple as that. I mean, there was two guys that exploited all the way to uh, the maximum, like, 25% or something. Um, and they were trying to brag about it. And they went to the Discord and the Facebook group and the Reddit trying to brag that it was them that had done it, expecting people to thank them. And, and everyone just launched on them. <laughs> like, go away, we hate people like you, you're wrecking the game. Exploits is still a thing. Yeah. There's a toxic minority that every game seems to have, and there's not a lot you can do um, other than ban them, and then they'll just make another account. It's it's sad, but, you know, there's, it, it's the same in society. There is always, for one reason or another, there are always, um, you know, a minority of people that you know we're gonna do harmful stuff that's you know a shame and you know maybe one day we'll, it'll be like star trek in the next generation but oh they caught them doing that you know all those accounts and sub accounts all got banned but i'm sure you know the kind of people they are they'll just make more accounts but you know funcom will be like well just keep doing it we'll keep banning you they can tell how they're doing it now so Yeah, when they couldn't win, when they couldn't win a base defense, they would cl crash the playfield. Which is, yeah, can't you? Yeah, just. I mean, I'm not saying, you know. It, it's like, how can you claim a victory doing something as as you know as as slimy as that? Yeah, it's horrible, you know. Yeah, there was, um, suddenly a load of people got banned. One of the major reasons, but not the only one. Yeah. Which game I liked to up, Tony. He was, a good, he was a good guy to chat to and play with and whatnot, but, you know... If you don't want to be in that game, you don't want to be in the game, do you? So, and he was he was much more into the PvP than I ever was. Ah, it's reset. Okay, right. That's what you've got to protect. So I don't know quite why he was killing it, but yeah. Protect you from the dark enigmas. Someone from the Omnicide has 75 paid accounts. They probably do. Some people have got, you know, huge amounts invested into the game. But, you know, if you do naughty things on the, on one of those accounts, you're going to lose all 75 of them. You know, so my, my advice is don't do it. You're not, you know, you, you, you're not helping yourself or the game, ultimately. So, up to you, but I would say don't. Is that considered a whale? Possibly, and then... Click on you to complete the mission. There we go. 201. So now, when I go back, it should give me the uh, Mantis Diggers mission. 
because I didn't really want to go back to uh, the uh, biome air dungeon again because it's sort of like yeah as long as you clone graces I don't think you can I think yeah, I think it might have been done before but I don't think you can now but we don't discuss exploits on the streams sorry same same rules as discord because you see if if I, if we discuss things like that here if effectively we are broadcasting amplifying what people are doing um that shouldn't be doing it you know what i mean no it's okay dude you, you know if no one told you that you you wouldn't know um uh, mantis cave yeah but you see you know there'll be like maybe three four hundred views here uh, on this stream maybe more and then the video will go on to youtube get a couple you know a couple of thousand views over a few months or whatever and i don't really want to promote you know oh this happens and this happens and this happens because as soon as you do that then um people go oh how you know and, and so I just, I just don't want to amplify wrongdoing so to speak not pretending that it doesn't go on because it goes on in every game but i just don't want to amplify it i'll condemn it every time because it hurts the game it hurts it hurts the people in the game uh so yeah of course i don't like it right diggers how are we gonna do in the subway oh someone's been in and been calming I might be doing the whole standing around waiting for things to respawn. I'm just behind someone. Digger! I need more concealment, obviously, because I can't sneak attack on them. Some people have, uh, have got so many creds in the game they can afford to buy the graces for all those characters. Oh, I'm on full death still. I thought it was. <laughs> but I was faster than this before. Where goes all my speed? I can hear somebody else in the distance shooting away there. Can we get it brighter in here? Not very, I don't think. No. Is that a bit dark on the stream? Can you guys see okay? Storm shield, I can see fine. Good stuff. No, I can see fine as well, but, you know, after something's um, been compressed for streaming, you don't know. Sometimes the blacks get crushed. The way around it is always set your, your colour uh, ratio to partial. Remember that the whole debacle with the, the night battle in uh, Game of Thrones and, like, 99% of the people couldn't see what the hell was going on? We're all sat there with the remote trying to turn the brightness up. It's because they filmed it in... in uh, full HDR, but not everyone's got that. So, yeah. I mean, these days, more and more people have, but not everyone. Mafio Zild? Is that a Troc shade? It is, yeah. We did a Nano Mage assault rifle shade uh, for a whole stream. Which I knew would be an absolute disaster, and it was. It was so painful, I, I couldn't even be bothered finishing the... Um, <laughs> the subway daily <laughs> before he got deleted next setup Trox wife well we'll see 
Mrs. Kalos 2 is playing the game again. I don't think she's playing right now. Um, but she's, you know, she hasn't played for over a decade, so at the minute, uh, she's just rolled a little low to kind of relearn on, which is what I recommend to most people, actually. Because the, the way your sort of memory retention works is you will tend to remember from the first things you did. Like, let's say you played guitar. Um and then put it down for a decade or so and then you know you decide you want to pick up guitar again start with the basics again until it starts coming back it's very much the, a similar sort of thing and next we're on the runners this is this is going incredibly well thanks to someone coming in here and calming virtually the entire first section of the dungeon I didn't mean your wife, Carlos, just in game. Well, yeah. Uh, uh, see, I timed it exactly right, Enzleric. I, I, I hydrated when you, you, <laughs> when you asked me to. I know it was not, it was the cup was to my lips when 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 you when you redeemed those Norton frags <laughs> it literally was so I sipped on I did my sip on behalf of you there you go Yeah, the old sneakeroo just before you attack. If you would get to a mob quick enough, it hasn't seen you, and you can you can get a sneak attack off. Always good fun, even if you don't quite meet the concealment. <laughs> Game logic, I know. That's what I get for going in in the kitchen. Okay, butterers. Okay, not as many calmed anymore, so we're gonna but we can we can tank a few at a time, so it's not too bad. Oh. Keep forgetting I've got acrobat. <laughs> we can't touch me. <laughs> Usually I return for to AO from time to time. You did a troc shade a few months ago, totally solo trip one. It's like a Disney walk, easy and enjoyable. Nothing wrong with that, you know. You aren't playing the game to have fun, you know. It's okay. I always thought Op Effect Shade was like, like easy mode shade, but everyone's saying no, do that Atrox. <coughs> Although I don't suspect you can, you can change uh, your spirits out in a fight. As quite as easily as you can on a, an op effect shade. <clears throat> like you'd have to hot swap a bunch more gear to do it. Just because of the sense and agility cap. You completed almost all quests solo. Yeah, the, they are very powerful, so, it, you know, as long as your perks land, you will survive. Scouts, okay. Okay, that was fun. Yeah, I've, I've, this is my third shade I've made. The first one is still kind of like my main shade, and then um, the second one I made was well, seven years ago now, and that was just for the uh, a veteran playthrough. What perks am I using? The usual. Uh, so we've got um, Totemic Rights, absolutely, because that's like the one to have. Uh, piercing Mastery. Oh. Uh, piercing Mastery, a bit in Shadow, a uh, little bit in Light Infantry. So, yeah. 
backstab and sneak attack. <laughs> All in one. Uh, I'm going to put another one in light infantry, just for higher AR. For now. But yeah, Totemic Rights is like your... That's the one you want. That will do a load of damage. It will also heal you. So hit mob for 10k, heal yourself for 10k at the same time. It's nuts. That's why... That's probably why... Um, Mafio was able to solo <laughs> like the entire game um, with enough know-how and resources yeah most of it I don't think you wouldn't have done the DB quest solo though I would have said maybe you did I would think that would be really quite difficult like the informant without an enforcer is yeah it's problematic No, going wrong way, going wrong way. Now we want foragers. Oh no. <laughs> That's for later. Foragers. Well, they are that way. I was thinking that. I'm sure you carry on and you find foragers. Yeah, there we go. Siljo Russell, welcome to the stream. You've got a funny for us. Uh, Hello, bucket, caterpillar, shoe, tape, dishcloth. <laughs> oh, bless. Yeah. <clears throat> Nano deck quest needed a team. Yeah, yeah. This, 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 like Inferno tours, all of those. Yeah, I can imagine you soloing that. Just the informant is a kind of team job, isn't it? Oh. It O Derry, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. We're storming this. Might change once we get to the battlings. Or bantlings. Got a Mitar solo tag. Nice. I've never I've never tried to solo that. Everyone says, oh it's quite doable on Engie. Never never tried it. <laughs> I saw someone doing it on a video and but it was sped up, so it's hard to follow what the hell they were doing. Um, it did look hard though. I could solo quite a bit on the on the other shade, so yeah, I can I can well imagine you're doing quite well with it, you know. There's Melders. Ah, uh, these got the debuffs now. Do I need to start thinking nano resist? I think maybe I do. Oh yeah, especially with um, yeah, I got too many on me. Too many. Hidey hole number one. So I'm sorry for the loss of the queen, but this was a bit too funny not to post. Okay, let's have a look. Yeah, okay, I'll allow that. It's not offensive. Without a queen to lay eggs, how will more British people be born? That's okay. That was probably posted <laughs> right after. They've been they've been waiting to use that joke. That's okay. Because it's, it's a silly... It's a silly joke. It's not 
offensive to anybody. Right, okay, so, Earth Melder. Can I just have one Earth Melder? Yeah, the one I was fighting. Let's go for that. This this mission area is so much better when you've got calms and stuff. <laughs> you can control all the mobs. I was, I was so happy when I walked in and someone had been in here calming everything. Oh, I'm not running any procs. Dun, dun, dun. And I should be running at least that. Tell no one she was the queen. She was head of state for other countries. She changed the colonial Britain into the Commonwealth. So people would benefit from, you know, rather than be sort of dominated or whatever. So she created the, mon the modern monarchy, basically. Completely changed it, in fact. I liked her. She was a nice old lady, you know. And she was always the same. She was always there. She always did the right thing. You know, she was she was like that kind of person. It was something constant in a world that's forever changing. Why have I got everybody else's ads now? Thank you. Thank you for your ads donation. Mate. Choo choo. <laughs> you can you can have them back. <clears throat> How's the fruit bad V? Oh yeah, and now that. Phil and Ito are here to raffle before I have to head out to dinner. Okay, yes, I will. Um, Not please to enter the raffle. It will be drawn in a in a couple of hours, thereabouts. Yeah, well, I normally stream two, three hours, so I will draw in two or three hours. What is the loot? The loot is an in-game grace. Constitutional monarchy Canada is a constitutional monarchy. That means the Queen or King. Yeah. Well, that's, that, that's what she was. She was the head of state. Uh, technically, she could veto what the government did, but never would. Uh, it, it's a, it is a complicated kind of... It's like a Mexican standoff kind of deal, you know? But, yeah. But, yeah, she, she buried her husband during lockdown. Um, they'd been married for 73 years or something like that. Uh, he was 99 when he passed as well. He had a pretty good innings. Um, and she, she, you know, even though she's the head of state, owns the church that they, they had the burial in, she was the only one there from her family because those were the rules. You know, that's who she was. Well, Canadians are like European light, aren't they? <laughs> Like, uh, the British feel like we've got more in common with, with Canadians than we do with um, Americans, usually. <clears throat> Even though we all speak English together. It's a weird sort of thing. Canada is just a wider version of Norway. <laughs> a lot wider than Norway. <laughs> God almighty. I don't know how many times wider, but it's a lot.
Yeah, even when our political leaders couldn't couldn't follow the rules they wrote, she did. That that is who she is. That's why it, it's people in Britain don't you know come up with you know this admiration or whatever because they they you know that because of fealty or something they come out of it purely from respect for her as a person that's what it is she never wavered you know well yeah she she was called in to look can you the only way to resolve this is dissolve the and and you know do over basically Right there. I think I remember that episode. Very impressive, Mr. Tubok. But when I said log out, I meant the ship's computer. I remember the episode. This is... Uh, oh. But I remember that happening, yeah. Which was... It was kind of weird. Oblix G Memories is probably 10 years plus since I played Anarchy Online. I know. It's been here that long. 21 years of Anarchy Online. Sig's not necessarily a monarchist. I am a, yeah, we, we've lived through the Elizabethan era. Into... What do well, we call it now? It's Charles now, but what do we actually call it? I'm not sure. I'm sure we, we'll be told. <laughs> someone someone reliable will, will say, Oh, it's now this. <clears throat> yeah, we're, we're in a new era now. Most of the people in Britain alive today have never known any other monarch, so, yeah. And I, I did feel sad when she died. I felt sad when um, famous people I've never met have died, you know. I feel like the world has lost something. When David Bowie died, I felt quite sad about that. But, hey, you know, it's, a, it's an inevitable thing, but it it's still like, hmm, when it happens, you know. Insane! Just finished work. I now have my full attention, sir. I'm glad the game is still alive. I've been gone a long, long time. Right, oh. Well, yeah, everyone everyone has breaks. I heard you're going to call him Carol III. Charles III. He's already said. He, the monarch themselves gets to choose. He could have chosen any one of his first names. You know, his first, second and third name. He could have chosen any one of them. Um, but he decided to just go with Charles III. So, there you go. And there you go, we have completed Le Daily. Where do I have to go for a dojo now, though? Looks a bit different. This is the Smuggler's Den dungeon. I've got to go to Sheol. Dun dun dun! Right, we're going to Shadowlands. King Charles, Charlie—he's never really been called Charlie he, in the UK. It's always just been Charles. You know, it's, just, it, it's one syllable, isn't it? When you when you come up with nicknames, usually you shorten the name. I don't know. But he's 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 been a royal prince for seventy years, so yeah, we can't we know who it's like he's not like who's this you know we know who he is. He's the longest because he was um, heir to throne. He's the longest heir apparent ever, <laughs> which is bonkers. But yeah, he was born. He was what four three or four years old. When Elizabeth became queen, and she became she was she was on holiday in Kenya, minding her own business, with a young family, and um, her father died suddenly, so she became queen all of a sudden. I thought so. Yeah, these things are still aggro. Inside of the virus, we had some funny costumes. Well, that's about the only good side or something like that. I did see some weird ideas. There was one guy who had a scuba scuba tank. I was like, well, yeah, you're all right, but no one around you is, because if you've got it, you're just breathing it out and breathing in clean air. Yep. 
Yeah, I've seen some of these in, in, out in the real, you know, out in the wild. I think that's just someone that doesn't want to get wet. Um, yep, sunbathing with your mask on. Someone's making sure. Inflatable. Well, that doesn't work. They're like those sumo suits you get inside. Only it goes over your head as well, so you just blow in air inside from outside. <laughs> I, I, that, could, that could be a thing. I don't know if they're filtered, but you'd have to have a seal. Otherwise, air's just going to come in from underneath. That's the scuba guy. Yeah. Yeah, as long as there's no COVID in that tank, he's fine. Well, it's a good splash guard. The daft thing is, all of these things actually do offer a small amount of protection. That's just post-apocalyptic fallout, that, isn't it? You know. That's, that looks like she was the first one to fall asleep at a party. That's what that one looks like. Yeah, I've seen this with the water bottles. I've seen that in the real life as well. Some of them are just bonkers. But, you know, people use their imagination. <clears throat> yeah, well, he wasn't always... He was a prince for 70 years, Mihalik, so he was a young man at one point, you know. He's just not a young man anymore. But, you know, that was typical of Elizabeth, you know, said, I, I solemnly swear to do this, you know, for as many days as I have. And she did. Oh, I've said it now, and that's it. Uh, greetings, you. good to see you once again. Um... I wonder if I'm trial for Sheol... Want to start my thing? 104, he should just let me go through. Feel as ready as I can get. one guy in your town who got a tattoo of a face mask because he was too tired he was tired to get to ask to put it on so that was his salute he's a moron what the hell it wouldn't <laughs> um i think i'll just go straight to sheol yeah Not a fan of the monarchy, bears my hand. But if you must have a king, wouldn't it be practical to skip to Charlie and go straight to Willie? It's not a corporation, mate. Um, it's not a corporation. It's not a talent show. There's a line of succession that needs to be followed. There it is. The instant Elizabeth died, Charles becomes king, or became king. Uh, and until he abdicates or dies, it doesn't pass to William. William is now the heir apparent. <coughs> you, you can't play leapfrog with it. It's, it's, it's not um, America's Got Talent or, I don't know, a beauty pageant. <coughs> Okay, that's it. We can get to Sheol. Personally, I think William would look better on the banknotes and coins and stamps, but, you know.
Well, it's their money to spend, Mahalik, so I wouldn't worry about it. See, people think that they, they don't make money or something? No, that's not how it works. They make billions of pounds a year as a family. What they then do is pay an enormous amount of tax on it and give it all to the government, who then, in turn, give them an allowance out of the money that they make to live on. It's their money. All right? There's a lot of misinformation about, oh, freeloaders, it's all taxpayers' money. No, it isn't. Okay, I'm falling down at God, how much lag today? <laughs> it's just bizarre. I was like trying to attack and then suddenly I'm back up in the air. Insignias. No, she, she's worth a lot more than that. Um, the family as a whole and the properties they own and everything else is worth an awful lot more than that. And they pay about that every year to the government and then get so much back as an allowance. So the money they get from the government is actually a small portion of the money they pay the government. So, yeah. Oh, personally, she probably had that much in a, a single account somewhere, yeah. But you add in all the land and property she owns across the world, uh, considerably more. Yeah, the firm itself is, is why they would have too much wealth to live in the country or something weird. So most of it the government take and then a small percentage of it they give back as an allowance. So they don't actually cost the country anything. They generate a lot of revenue for the country. The re I get a lot of anti-royalists claiming this and it's never been true. I mean, <clears throat> they own half of Westminster, the most expensive area in all of London, to rent, buy, pay council tax, all that. They own it. <laughs> it's, their, it's their land. That's why you can only get a freehold there, stuff like that. So all the revenue that generates goes directly to the government, who then pay out a small part of it to the Crown. So the whole concept, like, oh, these, these the, the, yeah, no, no, it's none of it's true. There's a lot of disinformation and misinformation about them, but this is not actually the case. But if you don't like them, you don't like them, it's fine. I don't care. Don't have to like the same things I like. I don't like every single person in the royal family. I did like the Queen, though. I mean, she was she was a good role model as a human being, effectively. Well, in fact, the Queen does hold a driving licence. And when she served in the military during the war, um, she trained as a mechanic. She could strip the uh, the army lorries and such down and she could also drive them very effectively and had an army driving license which she she surrendered at 75 or something no no i think she was 85 when she surrendered it and then one of the saudi princes came over to visit at the time women were not permitted to drive in his country and she drove him everywhere she makes a point You know, his, his limousine or whatever drops him off somewhere and then she goes I'll take you up to the house then and he gets in the Land Rover she gets in the driver's side and drives him there all the journalists click pictures of her driving him around hard not to like her Oh, women in, I understand, women in your country aren't allowed to drive. Imagine how well that conversation went. Oh. 
Yeah, she didn't have to, but she did because it's the right thing to do. No, she got a driving license in the army. <clears throat> you can you can learn to drive and get a driving license in in the forces. Good idea as well if you're going to serve because you don't have to pay for the lessons. <clears throat> Synchronized mooching. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> They're very short eared uh, for rabbits, aren't they? They're cute as all hell. And that's a very, very clean looking carrot. The dark-eyed makeup. <laughs> well, it must be some sort of breed of rabbit. I don't know which. Yay, we got a doja. Right, okay, so um, let's go hand this in. They're even nomming or only nibbling with their lips. It's a bit big to get their teeth round, yeah. Yeah, but we're not talking about abolishing the royal family on stream, Mahalik. It's not up for debate. Nothing we say will, will change it. So, you know. Yeah, <clears throat> there's a lot of disinformation, Mihalik. You know. We must take a breath of silence. It's not all fun games. For instance, we'll never play a video game. No, he had an Xbox. <clears throat> he was a, a helicopter pilot. And, no, I can't remember. Was it three or four tours he did? You'd never, you'd never know you were playing against him in a video game, but he played them. Twelve hours. I don't think he played WoW. Don't forget, he grew up very quickly. <clears throat> he was 15 in 97 when his uh, mother was killed in a car crash by the paparazzi chasing after her in a tunnel in France uh, so you know that's kind of the end of your childhood really isn't it so by the time WoW came out he was in his 20s at university so he might have played it, I don't know, but I would have thought by then he'd already met Kate. No, I wouldn't have been playing WoW. I probably wouldn't have been playing Anarchy Online if I'd have met someone like Kate. Because, I'm sorry, but she is a knockout. Um, <laughs> when, I, when they announced her engagement, I was like, You lucky bastard. <laughs> Hellgear Beardo, welcome. To the stream, Helgear, good to see you. Show the young woman your wrist on Rubicar 5. Soto Mahoney, welcome to the stream, good to see you. How the devil are you? <coughs> right, I think what we should do now is get the rest of Spectre. I got a couple of the books from the Yuttos quest. Yeah, I've got chapter one, chapter three. Why have I not got chapter two then? 
which one of their quests wouldn't one of their quests have been that megan is better than kate is the hill i'll die on well i'll come to your funeral not in a million years mate <laughs> not in a million years yeah uh. What's this? This is the image most know of the old king of Norway where he did take the trolley up to a skiing area and did not want to wake up the drivers or guards to take him. Oh, so he drove it up himself? <laughs> Fair play. The king is the one paying the ticket. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> that's kind of cool really right we could just go and farm the rest of those books i thought you got all but number two from doing the work so i must have missed one of the yuttos quests then which one gives which one gives you all the books let's just consult the oracle that is anarchy online universe Right, at least the um, spec, spec to book two. I should have got that then. The open dialogue, blah blah. Oh, it's killing all the named. Pre oh, I can't be asked. Okay, what about book four? All oh, right, we'll just go. And f we'll just kill name mobs. It looks like Ringo Starr is sitting behind him. It does a little bit, yeah. A 70s Ringo Starr, yeah. So that's... The, um, so that's the... the let's... So this is the king here, paying the ticket. Okay. <laughs> Just slap there like anyone else, yeah. King Olaf. That's him, yeah. He did pass away in 1991. <laughs> Time to eat soon. Have a nice stream. Thank you, Enzleric. Nice to see you as always. Uh, where do we want to go for the unread temple? Antidote, welcome to the stream. How are you? Has not seen you in a little while. Well, not since Saturday, I think. Did I see you before then? Maybe I did. I think the quickest way there is to run north from Kronos. Can oh no, go to Remains and yeah, that's it. Have you noticed how just being a king is the ticket to the hottest girl in the world? <laughs> it's It's the wealth and power, isn't it? It's part of it, yeah. Mind you, you see, Prince William is, you know, even even now is considered like quite an attractive man. Um, I mean, thankfully, he took after his mother for his looks, but yeah. Uh, his mother, Diana, was, you know, very attractive. Well, I have seen Kate in real life, and I tell you, there is no picture I have ever seen of her that does her justice. She's an absolute knockout, mate.
that said, there was a bit of debate about whether her sister had a cuter um, <laughs> behind uh, at their wedding as a bridesmaid. She came and like uh, crouched down to do something, and then I think a bunch of people went, "Gee, look at Kate's sister." <laughs> <laughs> it's nuts. It's kind of I like athletic women. That's why there's no waving at you in game since I really I wasn't really online in AO at that time. Oh right, okay. Yeah, there you go. Could have ducked out, could have, you know, could have hidden out in Canada for the entire war. Nope. I'll serve. There she is. And she enjoyed the work as well. Kate Middleton's sister. Oh, yeah. Yeah, at the wedding, she, um like especially the outfit she had on as well um <laughs> turned a lot of heads a lot of people went what <laughs> um is that chapter God, i can't even read that chapter one we've got and don't need I mean, I, I don't know if I'd say Elizabeth was better looking than um, Kate at the same age. She was very good looking, yeah. Chapter two. Yay, there we go. Right, just need to find number four now. Then we can hand spec two in. Yeah, and when you see a picture of um, <clears throat> of Elizabeth when she's young, yeah, she's surprisingly good looking. Chapter one again. Yeah, before she went, yeah, she... Oh, Marin's father, wow. Yeah. She was still doing her job. Even though she was, like, hospital, hospitalised at home. She was in hospital care at home, effectively. <clears throat> but still did her duty. Chapter one. It's popular, chapter one, isn't it? Yeah, she was. You could see the, the bruising on her hands from a drip or something. Or something else, I don't know. Chapter 2. That oh, can't be attacked. Yeah, she she just... Uh, her mind was, uh, you know, sharp as, a, sharp as a pin. It was just her body gave out on her, really. Chapter one again. I think we'll kill some trash while we're here. How good are we full there? Curious now. Yeah, she put she put a job above, you know, herself every time. I think a lot of the problem is a lot of people have watched the trashy um, dramatizations about them that are more have more in common with Dallas or Dynasty than anything else. No real relation to the per people they're portraying. Um, 
which is why they they didn't like those shows being made because they're being misrepresented but they're not allowed to directly you know take action against that and say you know take any they can't take any legal recourse against it even if they're being grossly misrepresented and i think that happened a lot all of the dramatizations it, they try and make it like some corporate warfare in an oil company with everyone vying for the top job it's like no because you're no better off or worse off in that job than you are without being in that job you've still got loads of responsibilities and stuff you've got to do it's expected of you from the day you're born and to be honest with you i don't think charles ever wanted the crown they have, they have this whole bs narrative that oh he only married diana so he could become king that's a bit of a stretch in speculation and he can't directly speak to it you know Oh, the, the Queen Mother, yeah, we thought she was going to go on forever as well. Time for a smoke, so laugh at this. Okay. Poop alone, poop with friends. <laughs> poop alone. As, as nice as, as poop with friends looks, I'm going to pass. Can't be attacked. Okay. Go find some more victims. Oh no, I love getting the flu on your second to last day of work before your very busy days off. Oh, my dude, Daylight's welcome to the stream. Good to see you. We're doing more with the, the little truck shade he's a level 106 currently so we're trying to finish off spec two just need one more book book four time to shake the rust off my dock and kill some eli rocks <laughs> yeah i don't want to power level the tomb but i am kind of playing it you know to get on kind of thing there is currently a raffle running type loot please to enter is for a in-game grace so you do need to be to claim it you do need to be able to log into game day quill and night quill are my friends oh it's like day nurse and night nurse is it Loot, please, for the grid to uh, an entry into the grace draw, which I will do near the nearer the end of the stream. If you win and you've had to go, don't worry. Uh, we will make a note of it and do it on the next stream. Yeah, with a hash, not a thing. I don't know why. <laughs> Just, that's the way Moobot worked. Chapter two again. I'm going to kill the quest one. Kill you, though. Bosk, welcome to the stream. I know he is a quest one, but... Lovely Bosk, yes. <laughs> it said lovely people, so we get lovely Bosk. Okay, nothing doing there. And regular mobs, okay. What's the Cap Corporal Ashley Winstead quest reward for Shade? Is it the health trade? Can't remember now. We're not quite high enough level to do all that, but... Zinzig, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Is 
Is it faster than your shadow? Oh, I want to do the quest. 106 already. Power level. No, not at all. People who power level would be 220 by now since this character was created. Right, we need book four. And of course, book four. Yeah, you need to be 120 to do the last stage of the quest. I know. Or more accurately, the second stage of the quest. So a bit early. Yeah, I couldn't. I can't remember. You know, every reward for every class, even though I have done it on every class, because I think it's the only way you get that nano, isn't it? Okay, these have only just respawned. Who was the first one we killed? Was this guy down here, wasn't he? Chapter one. Damn you. It just doesn't want to drop. Oh, can I attack you yet? Does not want to drop. Chapter four. Target cannot be attacked. Okay, he's still on his timer. He must be close. You're unable to attack this target. After the bow, I forced through the Sheol quest for the MP nuke. Yeah. Are the uh, special edition rapiers are they are they better than the nippies or are 160 nippo nippies better anyway can't remember be good xp for the dock yeah definitely Target can't be attacked. Come on. There's another bunch of named mobs somewhere, but... Damn you. No, can't attack any of these yet. I remember the order I killed these in, so... I can attack this one. Weird. No, nothing doing there. How about you? Target can't be attacked. He can. Funny which ones have got a timer and which ones haven't. You're unable to attack the target. I would have thought the guy down here would be attackable. Ah, oh, he's attackable now. Yay. Come on, drop book four so we can finish this. You watch, none of them will. <laughs> All right, now. Book four. Yay. Finally. Okay, so that's book four done. Uh, spec two done, rather. MP got all the pets in the backpack from 150 onwards. Those two are a nice distraction from doing Inferno missions on my trader for my enforcer. Oh, yeah, I'll bet. I'll go hand this in and then we're on to spec two. Yay.
the way I usually do this, uh, you only really need to farm spec one and spec... Um, well, you only need to farm spec two. Uh, spec one, you just get the quest and kill... And we'll get one drop. And that completes it. And then... Spec two, you do have to farm it. Whoa, New computer fund or take MS Coloss two out for supper. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you very much for the fifty seven dollars and ninety three cents. New computer fund or take Miss Callas two out for supper. New computer fund. Um Yes, we'll 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 have to make a decision on that. Um <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Much appreciated. I know you've uh, you've invested a lot of money in your condo and everything, so I really do appreciate it. Well, I sent it as GB pounds. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, maybe it's they they've done their conversion. We did it. Just got confirmed. Miss Callus two does not watch his streams. No, she can hear them from downstairs, probably. It's a day off today, so she was playing a bit this morning, and I was going, "Yeah, I'll have this, have that." Why? It's not a dojo, you doofus. Um, yeah, so she was doing that early this morning, uh, and then she went out for some lunch. What uh, I can do? Thank you very, very much, Excelsior, with ten dollars. Thank you. Yeah, uh, and she went out for coffee with a friend. And then she came home. I went out and did the shopping on my own. Well, uh, with number one son. Men and picked him up from the station. He was back from military prep college. Picked him up. We went shopping and bought loads of junk food. <laughs> so I've got loads of, loads of junk to eat over the weekend. Um, what the hay. Yeah, and then I picked her up after a coffee date with a friend and she probably had something to eat and nodded off now she might be playing later on yes I was going not just too far but completely in the wrong direction thinking and doing at the same time and failing at both that is the way I have something for you. Goodbye. Right, what should we do next then, folks? What would be a good plan? Solo Tara. I don't quite think that's on the cards. Does anyone know the timer on Tara? I've not seen a, a thing come up yet. For the Tara tag mission. I did buy some VP because I'll want a load of um, stuff on this character from the veteran point stuff. Get to 159 so I can leech off your golem. Oh, do you need an ice golem? Um, I think I've used all the ones I had. I think. Almost done with my four cheese pizza. After that, I hope Kite Hill leaves SB Spawns alone. <laughs> and see what type of rifle you can get on. What? No. Soldier, oh my god, look, he had a quick reaction. What's this? Whoa, yeah. Zinzig! Daylight's gifted a tier one sub to Zinzig. They've gifted 141 subs to the channel. Thank you very, very much. Throwing sticks in the fire. Yeah, I'd have got the cat out there just... I'm surprised the cat didn't get itself out of there any quicker than that. <laughs> Jesus. Whoa. Probably got his whiskers singed there. Mind you, it was a sticky through in, so maybe just just lighting it. It's not got any real heat to it yet. Oof. <laughs> How 
How's the cat, honey? Well, <laughs> it jumped in the furnace. Yeah, good reaction time. Left hand as well. It's like that. You can pull missions, can't you, for Sheol? Well, I'm not sure. Is that something we want to do? Do we want to pull missions for Sheol or maybe something else? Left-handed better than right-handed. Mrs. Callos too is left-handed. You use it. Well, I'm ambidextrous. Well, not completely. I can't write with my left hand, but I can do anything. You know, I can operate even scissors. But of course, scissors are backwards if if you're left-handed. If the handles are like that, those are just ones I use for cutting tape. Um, pliers are not. So yeah, those are my big pliers. These are regular pliers, but obviously in, in my hands they're <laughs> little tiny things. <laughs> ah, Zinzig redeemed hydrate. Thank you very much. I will. I'm going to get some water. So I won't be that long. There we go, I've hydrated their dead. And the same due to being forced to do all right hand my brother. And being left-handed is a disability. No, it is. Whoa! One of my cats did jump onto the fireplace after it had been burning all day long. Four paws with big burns on it, so the cat was needing shoes and incendiary salvo treatment for three months. After that, it was never jumping onto stuff before he touched it first, I'll bet. You know, cats are in quite intelligent animals, as in they can learn. Um, yeah. I'm lucky, you know. So what do we want to do then, folks? We've done all the dailies. We've got spec two. Yeah, I know what you meant. Um, incendiary salvo, burn lotion. So it's salve in in English, or solve. More more commonly now called ointment. And daylights will tell you all about it because he's a medic. <laughs> incendiary salvo is what Google translated it to. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. A salvo is, um, it's usually a, a, like a bunch of um, projectiles being shot. Or a salvo is also somewhere you store a collection of ammo. But ointment would be the real or cream would be the proper translation. Bosk, what is the bluish buff that kind of looks like grid armor? That is this, a Cascading Energy Cascade. And I'll show you if you're neutral or clan, uh, you can get it from the lady by the Wampers called Stella Barnes. She doesn't have it all the time, but quite often she does. She'll have this running in her NCU, which is the plus 10. And if you talk to her, show the young woman your wrist, and she gives you that buff. Uh, it lasts two hours, I think. Yeah, two hours. And it gives you 10 to all base abilities, 2% XP gain, first aid for 20. 
Um, gives you more max nano and more max health. Uh, there's a um, another there's a little Atrox guy in Omni Trade. So if someone um, wins Gauntlet and takes an item to him, you can get the exact same buff from that guy. An Atrox dock with combined mercenary does not have the most nano points. <laughs> you'll be all right by the end. Come end game, you'll be fine. Get that recompiler nano cost buffs and whatnot. You'll be all right. I mean, we could make a start on the um, Corporal Ashley Winstead or wait until we're 120 and do the whole thing and get the nano at the end. Oh my god, Daylight's Redeemed Sing Mode for 50,000. I thought I'd put people off with that price. Okay. Well, what I think we should do is not sing anything that will get a copyright claim. So I'm going to go back to Sheol and roll a mission from there. I'm not sure what way this tune is gonna go but <laughs> we will have to see this remains the way i wanted to go with probably the wrong one it is but never mind we'll run from here to where we wanted to go which is sheol i don't know why anyone wants to use sing mode i'm not even a good singer I sound like an old pirate for some reason. I don't know why I'm singing that way, but I are. <laughs> Siljar Russell. All my docs been solicitous. And I only had nano points pre six lock belt. Zinzig, redeem check posture. You slap my slouching. Come on, get up the thing, guy, uh, you useless lump. <clears throat> I want to torture everyone for five minutes, especially me, who has to do the singing and not actually being a singer. So I just end up sounding a bit David Bowie. <laughs> I love David Bowie. <laughs> I, I end up trying to sound like him and probably doing him a great and death service. Siljar Russell, hydrate and another hydrate. Thank you. Pirates are awesome. Well, those in stories, not the real ones that are around today. Well, they were no real different uh, than the real ones around today. We, we, we we basically um make you know we glamorize them to the ridiculous levels you know to turn them into robin hood sort of characters where in actual fact pirates were you know they were criminals like the pirates of today <laughs> stealing ships and people and selling them into slavery you know they're a pretty pretty nasty lot really I'm not sure if you see this on Discord, but IDE for next time your wife work at night. What have we got? Oh, I did see it, yes. But it's worth repeating. If you can read the sign, it says, Warning, huge aggressive spider undercup. Do not pick up until ready to squish it. And then, you know, done the, it's broken out of there thing it's pretty good i wonder if someone just put a cup like that and then someone put the put the label on it for the lols actually the term viking actually meant pirate in almost well the, the original vikings you know they came over to rape pillage and, and whatever i mean a lot of them when they got to as far as britain they went far enough west went oh look at all this arable land we could farm on and decided to settle you know
Yeah, her mind never ever wavered. I mean, God Almighty, she she put up with Boris Johnson and Liz Truss in the same day on Monday. More than my brain could cope with now. <laughs> but yeah, she was sharp as a tack. Fair play. I doubt I'll I'll be in as good a shape. I doubt I'll get as I doubt I'll live as long. All right, have you got an insignia for me? I should have picked one up the last time I got here, shouldn't I? It's okay, dude. She was an old lady. We knew it was coming. It is sad that she's gone, but... <laughs> Mine isn't even half as sharp as hers was. <laughs> That's me being 31, I know. There's no hope for his mate. Oh, I've got a doja for tomorrow then. Um, the bloke, one of her aides, um, told the story. They were in Scotland where she loved Scotland. She loved, she had a castle there. And uh, they were, they'd gone for a picnic. Um, and two American tourists were walking uh, along the path where they were, you know, it's public land. And, um, and they got talking and they said, um, no, you know, we're here from so-and-so in the States and blah, blah. Neither of these guys recognising uh, the Queen. You know, if you're not expecting to see her, you probably wouldn't recognise her, you know, it's one of those. Um, and they're talking away to the, to the guide and everything. And he's saying, oh, are you on holiday or not? And she says, well, I've, I've been coming here for 80 years, she says. And I go, really? Hey, yeah, wow. And he says, yeah, I've got a holiday home over there. And they're like, oh, really? Yeah. Hey, you must have seen the Queen then. She comes here a lot. And <laughs> Elizabeth says, oh, I have He has to her aid and and he goes is that right you've seen it yeah oh what's she like <laughs> so he says oh she's right very decent uh, uh lady he says, she can be a bit much at times but you know she's got a wicked sense of humor and like straight face the, the american guy said oh yeah can you yeah let and got the queen to take a picture of him his mate and the guy they'd met and then said oh we'll get one of you as well and then took her and off they trot and she just turned around to the aide and said something along the lines of, I'd love to be a fly on the wall when he shows that picture to someone who recognises me. <laughs> She's like, like this in the picture, you know, hello, <laughs> in the selfie shot. I just thought I was brilliant. I was when, when she was in her 90s, she was that sharp. I saw a tweet from Sid Vicious. I don't know if it's Photoshop. Sid Vicious has been dead for like 40 years, mate. So I'm pretty sure it's not real. <laughs> Do you mean Johnny Rotten? Are you having this? That's another doger in Sheol if anyone needs one. Of course it's BS. <laughs> when did... I'm curious now. It's been years, like, but let's have a look. When did Sid... V his die? 1979. So, yeah, I don't think he tweeted anything. <laughs> <laughs> every day is april 1st when you're on the internet remember the golden rule every day is april 1st when you're on the internet all right we're grabbing that and getting into the garden 
Now, it's almost certainly he never said that. <coughs> Look shop too. Of course it was. I, I've seen th clips from movies, um, really old movies that have been colorized and then framed as here's, here's Queen Elizabeth when she was young doing this in this country and then it's not until three re, you know re, three thousand retweets and, and oh I hate them and blah, blah, blah. and then you get um where's the forester dude someone points out that's from this and this such and such a movie Isn't there a forester guy in here somewhere? Yeah, every day is April 1st on the internet. Yeah, that, well, that's it. I mean, if you if you're cautious on um, April the first, because people post a lot of rubbish, that's no different than April the second through till you know the whole year basically. So every day is April first on the internet. Do not believe anything you read on the internet unless you fact check it, because more often than not, it's complete horse manure. He's a diviner. It's the forester you need to pull missions, isn't it? Is there no shield missions? Because there was one in uh, Elysium. Yeah, and so Sid, Sid Vicious <laughs> definitely didn't tweet anything. No, your conserver such and such a body. There's no one down here in the water. Is there a forester for missions in Sheol, or do you have to go all the way to Adonis for one? Why would they skip Sheol, though? That doesn't make sense. There's one in Elysium. I would have thought there'd be one in, uh, in Sheol Garden as well. I've never looked, but... He's usually kind of here, if there is one. And he's got nothing to tell me. Did the devs hate Sheol so much they didn't put missions in it? Possible. Um, I think a lot of the devs probably really liked it, but... There's things in the Shadowlands that obviously were destined to do something, but never ever did. Never got turned on, and I, I to this day don't know what some of them were supposed to be. Well, I'm not seeing a forester anywhere, which... Has kind of scuppered that plan. I'll have to go all the way back to. I don't know what level missions do you get in Elysium from the forest of there? Is he not just in a weird place? It's the conserver, the usual vendors, and the guy for that. Is there just no forester here then? I thought there was one in every garden. I I've obviously was wrong. Well, that's a bugger, isn't it? 
I'm in Sheol Garden, there's one. Come back. Where am I going? Is this you? Spirit Gaze! You're standing beside him. I have nothing to tell you. What level would you have to be then? To get missions from him. My too low level. Maybe, yeah, maybe 110. Old garden key quest, that's not what I wanted. No, not key quest. Right, let's try a different search. Shuttle uh, location, uh, quest guides. It just shows you the quest guides. I'm sure I've, I've seen an article that talks about the forester in there. Someone with a rotten exhaust. No, nothing comes up. Right, I'm guessing I need a few more levels then. It's one thirty in Adono and they do not overlap. Yeah. So you think one ten? Could be. We could do the first couple of stages of uh, the Sheol quest, just a power level. You're one five one and he won't talk to you. He's not blue named either, is he? Hmm. Yeah. Man back with the lag. This isn't one that's gated by having actually having the key, is it? Because a lot of people, I, I keep hearing that from people. Oh, I, I can't pull Inferno missions. I haven't got the key. And I'm like... I mean, I don't need a key to pull the mission. You need a key if you want to get in the garden every time really quickly, but... you um, Yeah, well, obviously it's not the key that's in question. Maybe it's a level thing. You're too high level at 151. I'm sure there's an article for that on AOU, you know, but I can't find it at the moment. Let's get to 110. We should be able to do that fairly quickly with all the XP gear we're wearing. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll try and get to there and then see if we can't pull a forest emission from him. <clears throat> no chance to read, sorry. I just want the shortest dialogue with him. So do you have a job for me? It's two jobs he gives you, and the Clear Thought 3 gives you another one. That should be two, three levels. Welcome to the chat room. Oh god, is the stream misbehaving? Please say the stream is being okay and not being weird. No, it's still live. Why did it suddenly say welcome to the chat room? 
which freaks me out that the catacomb part of the shield quest is what annoys me yeah yeah the stream is still running okie dokie it just suddenly popped up in in my um chat window i was like <laughs> does that mean i just disconnected or something Oh, damn, I'm white. Yeah, the key quest comes up. Uh, Forrester. Yeah, that's for the actual key quest, isn't it? Which is not what we need, but thank you. No, that that's a different thing. <clears throat> that's the actual key quest that you can get um missions you know like old inferno missions you've probably done some of them um and you talk to the forester to pull them and they introduce them for each garden as far as i knew anyway i got a full team for killing eli hex that's such a good place i would level quickly there but Your team is full, and it's not very interesting to watch on a stream. All right, we've got to do the fine belts and then kill a couple of them. Down to the bone is kill three aggressive. Okay. I mean, if you're running around in Eli killing them as a team rather than kiting them, it's great XP. Not as fast as a kite team, but infinitely more fun. If that's what you meant. <laughs> and in nostalgic, yeah, yeah, yeah. The first hecklers we were killing, I think, in... Um, we killed a few in Elysium, but I was already level 200 when Shadowlands came out, so. So we were trying to get to Adonis as fast as possible and then started killing them there. These guys don't drop anything, I don't think. <clears throat> Yeah, killing them on the beach. That's what I remember the most. Ooh, granite spider from nowhere. I'm guessing someone was getting chased by it, and now he's with us. One ten would also be good, I think, or is it one twenty for that one? 120, yeah. Uh, for that line from Totemic Rites, making it even more powerful. This is the Adono Hex I killed back at the spot and all the way. Yeah, that's it. We used to go on the east side because it was near a garden exit. Up and down and up and down. People still do them over there. The southeast spot is probably the most popular. The, the, pro the problem wasn't the availability of mobs for killing. The problem was the availability of faction. That's what really made Shadowlands so damned hard. As soon as they fixed the the problem with faction, it was it was way way easier. In fact, as soon as they they did, you know, as soon as they introduced the mission system in uh, in in Shadowlands, it fixed Shadowlands effectively. People could level at 
less than a shadow level a month, you know, which is what it felt like at the beginning because nobody had any faction. So we're getting two or three points per kill instead of a few hundred, you know. Oh yeah, loads of people would say, okay, we'll go up to this spot and you do the rest of this bit. And they'd be sat around waiting on respawns and yeah, loads of fun times. Oh, it took a, it took nearly a year to get up to um, 200 because there was no daily missions or anything. And kiting Borgs was sort of a thing, but not really. Is this in-game music? Yeah. Shadowlands battle music. As long as you're outdoors, you get this. Yeah, you would kill Borgs, but it would be more kind of, um... Where's yours? Control your mob. It's like, I go somewhere and suddenly everybody else shows up. See me bounce. Doing lag. the risk it was yeah in the in the days of old i remember when the first borg um came into game and it was kind of like um they were going killing the more borgs um but it being 25 percent gas getting flagged and killed that was the wrong wrong one oh well. i pulled him i kill him Pets always pull tons of ads. Never use your pet to pull. Are you killing all of them, are you? Is that your plan? Fine. Do the other bit of the other quest then. Yeah, I know, he, he was pulling with that, he's like, no, mine, mine, mine. It's like the bloody seagulls in Finding Nemo. Mine, 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 mine. <laughs> Need a limping biat, or however you pronounce it. There you go, we've got a limping yet. And a regular yet. Got that. Return, and then we want some aggressives. If he's hunting for doges, he'd be gutted. I found two, one after the other. <laughs> Menenza, when did you. They open the one month free. Because that's the. Uh, the First time they did a free month? I don't honestly know. Quite a while ago. Many, you know, quite a few years ago, the first time they did it.
Can't deny if I pronounce them bite or bait. Yeah, biet it looks like, but I'm like, hmm, but yeah, it doesn't look like a regular. It's not an English derived word, biet. So I'm not too sure. Got to pull some bloody boss thing, right? Okay. Kill one more aggressive biet. I would, but uh, proper riled up at the moment. Even pulled a named one that I'm not interested in. Maybe should have come this side, not the other side. Have got an aggressive one over? No. Oh, yeah, we all love the lag. You know, I'll just go bugger off and reset you lot. You want to pronounce it as bite or beat? Yeah, I know what yeah, beat might be right, actually. Lady Sky Cannon, welcome to the stream. How the devil are you? I only want this one. They all followed me. The giraffe legs and. Yeah, faster than your shadow would be nice about now. <laughs> We're out of here. Goodbye. Legs that don't look like they could possibly support the body. Just farming stuff in pen on the MP. Nice. A chill evening in Penumbra. There is currently a raffle on if you want to join. It's hashtag loot please. Uh, and that's for a in-game grace as, as the uh, as the prize. Right, I now want the gulag, whatever they're called, dudes. I have to kill five. I think I only need two more. Unless the seagull is still here. Mine, 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 mine. <laughs> Look, please, there you go. It's an in-game grace, so you will need to be have a, access to GMI to claim it. I think I only need two more of those, if that. Zizon, welcome to the stream. Nice to see you. Hope you're all having a fine evening or morning or, yeah, whatever time it is. Whichever time zone you're in. There's so many of them. Yeah, it's hashtag loot plids with a Z on the end. That's the one. There you go. Eleven people in the in the raffle. So it's an in-game grace. So what we will do is you'll tell me a character and then make a grace by order for, you know, like a pin number. And then I'll sell it to you for that amount. 
So, you know, like one, two, three, four or something, but obviously <clears throat> just so we know, make sure we are selling it to the right person. Ninety-five bill, yeah. It's a big payday if you if you win it and then sell it. Very big payday if you win it and sell it. <laughs> Converting a couple of thousand into ninety-five billion credits is rather a lot. Yeah, prices always go up nearer the weekend and then come down again midweek. Not always, but quite often. Oh, come on, Glugger, whatever they're called. Glugger, 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 I think it actually is. I'm not sure. How do you get the money out? Uh, you, one billion at a time until you're under the four billion. Then create a buy order for something that cannot be sold for that. Like a, a backpack or if you want to play it safe, make a buy order for a grace for three billion or four billion. Uh, then take the money out of the mail system, one billion at a time, and put it back into the bank till you're just under the limit. And then either modify the original buy order or create a new buy order I, I prefer creating a new buy order then when I want to buy anything I just cancel the order um, and do that until you've taken all of the money out of um, out of the mail system whatever you do do not leave money in the mail system it if the email tie, um, expires the creds are gone and there is no getting them back they're gone. The other option is have one tune to hold all that money on. Yeah, you might not be able to do it all in one go. On a player, they do. Players can only have one billion. GMI is a four billion. You can put any amount of creds in GMI, but it stops working if you go over four billion. The creds are there, they're safe, they're not going anywhere, but you can't spend them. You can only withdraw them. You can't even create buy orders till you get under the four billion. Yeah, it, do, it takes time uh, to do it. But once you've done it, you've done it. And then you just need to remember to renew the buy orders. <laughs> Otherwise, you forget. And then you log in and, oh, I've got to do it all over again. As long as you remember to refresh your buy orders. Just set a calendar alarm on your phone or something. You know, it's not, it's not too hard. And always set it for like one day before. So you've got bags of time. You'll be all good. Carl, I'm also waiting for a good friend to come back and we're leveling or we're we are leveling good old school way. Alright, okay. Could be fun. I mean the game is certainly more fun with other people. It is designed to to be so. You can thank Vab for creating GMI in its current form. Yeah, I miss the old player sh uh, stores in the player cities. 
but after the server merge they there wasn't enough cities okay i did enjoy them you know because you'd go there for one item but while you were there you'd go and browse everybody else's store if you had the time you know and quite often you go oh yeah i think i need that for this character and you just you know and people would name their shops fun and interesting things you know it was it was it was fun i used to enjoy them but it is undoubtedly much easier and more convenient to do it all through gmi So what are we now? 107. I thought we'd get another level just killing stuff for those first two mission stages. So hopefully with all the XP percent we've got, I don't know if it's going to affect the reward or not. But I found the beats you said where they would be. Right, so that's 108. And then, lots of words, found the beer bones you wanted. Even though I had to run away from that when I was on the wrong side of that canyon doing that. That was my own dumbass fault. There we go, and that's 109. I'll pick up the next part of the quest, but I'm not going to do all of Sheol quests now. Be here till midnight. <laughs> And I don't know if I could solo it anyway. All right, goodbye on that one. Clear thought three. I've chased out the things. Oh, it's not much XP. I thought you got more. Oh. Well. Is one oh nine enough, or is it one ten? One of my stores was named used underwear as I sold the thongs from Crypt of Home. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Mine was called Kalos 2's Little Shop of Horrors. There was never anything really that interesting in there. But everyone liked the name. Occasionally, you'd find a, a like a, a player vendor store that had um, loads of really good stuff in it that was meant to be guild only, so it would be like one cred for everything. But they'd um, not set it as guild only, and you just go, <laughs> you just empty it. Find the one we're developing with. Right, we need one ten, we think, don't we? Well, do we? We'll, we'll try talking to the guy first. It's not a million miles different. Found old beat bones. Oh, that's quite a quick. That's a blitzy mission, isn't it? Um, Mirador. That's the one I want. The Crypt of Home Thongs of Win. There's some weird stuff in this game when you think about it. I auctioned off themed goodie bags as Backpack Shopping Channel. It's highly funny how high the bits got. I can imagine, yeah. We go anti-clockwise and avoid the high-level boss-type mobs as we run around. Or hopefully miss them as we run around. How is my run speed? It could probably do with going up a bit. Yeah. And 
faster than your shadow I should have got before coming out here. Now if you go on the left side there's like a boss that can snare you. Right, find old bones. Let's have a look at the mission. Well, long, yeah, it's probably going to be. Somewhere down here. No. I'm not killing everything walking around in this mission either. Started off as a joke. Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, I think we've come all the way west. And there they are. Quite impressive sort of rooms, some of these, really. The suspension support for the bridge actually looks like it could work. lag spirit no we don't want that kind we don't want any lag spirits here I've not seen one of those before i don't think at least i, I don't oh no not that way i don't remember seeing one before whaling yeah plenty of those No. I hate when the um, the map doesn't expose the corridors as you explore it. Just trying to remember how the hell to get out is a nightmare sometimes. I love the AO music. It's, it's classic, isn't it? That's the thing. Yeah, here we go. No, my map is gone. So is it possible to level from 100 to 220 with just enough missions? Mission complete? Yeah. Yeah. If you just do nothing but dailies, then yeah. And welcome to the stream, Tom Riddleston. I ain't running all the way back. That's what the insurance re recall beacon's for. Yeah, there's enough. I mean, if you think about the XP you get in a daily mission or something, you get more for the, the hand-in than you do for the entire mission. Usually, anyway. Right, passage to the Highlands. Colorish run speed on shade. It's not great, is it? Oh, it is. It is green. I was thinking. I'm sure it's not terrible. Tom Riddleston, subscribe with Prime. They've subscribed for five months. Thank you very much for the resub. And thank you for the five months. Much appreciated. Thank you. Mm. 
an Adonis garden. It's Essence Hunter that gives the missions, right? No, not you. You! I found the bones. Where the hell are they? Did I not pick them up? Return with old bones. Well, I can't find them. Did I not pick them up? Well, that's a bugger, isn't it? <sighs> Delete mission. <sighs> I must not have picked them up. I, I targeted them, but didn't actually pick them up. Right, so same location again. <sighs> what a doofus. I must have double clicked on it and then done, but the key had gone, so I had to pull the mission a second time. Have I saved lately? I wouldn't have mattered, okay. Yeah, I love the AO music as well. I'm always surprised when people go, oh, I can't play with the sound on. Like, what, really? I love the, the music and the ambience and... Yeah, that is all a really big part of it for me. I mean, hey, you know, if you don't want to have the sound on, that's fine, you know, you you do you. That's what, We're all good. Um, <clears throat> But... Yeah, I, I, playing without sound, I would feel like it was half the game, to be honest. Right, Mirador again. And we go bigger on evades. Oh yeah, and HP. Go for those. Did my max nano resist? I must not. I saved it. Exploring, I did save. Melee weapons. Nice More sneak attack for better backstabs and such. Okay. So in the Adonis Garden, it's Essence Hunter that gives the missions, right. Yeah, rock. Don't mind the sound in the games, when it comes to the music, no preference. Oh, I much prefer it. Sometimes I don't realise I've been attacked, but the music will give me a clue that I have. And the outdoor battle music in Shadowlands I think is really, really cool. These hit pretty hard. Even at full death with evades maxed out. Okay. Looks like a very similar mission, actually. Ah, uh, no, it's not because the, 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 the floor plan updates. Yay! I hate when it doesn't, because I, I, it's like, I am lost. Nope, not in here. Big ass mission. 
Yeah, I usually like the music. Maybe not... God, lag. Maybe not... Um, as Like, the default volume of the music in AO is 100%. It's too much. Because you can't hear anything else once it kicks in, so... My preference is that it's... It's there, but quite a bit quieter. Ah, here we go. Right, I've definitely picked them up now. Bye, guys, he said, clicking the beacon. Chubby shade, best shade. Absolutely. And he will be wearing uh, full tier one in social. It's already decided. Ah, no. Wow. Had them just as I wanted them. Yeah. You can see through the uh, the blue there. Got tier one dropped for um, daily login reward yesterday. It was like, yay! <laughs> That's one less piece to farm all the bits for. Okay, let's talk to him again and then try the forester. Right now, when we give him these bones, my hope is we hit 110, and then we can try talking to the forester dude, finally. We've earned this level. <laughs> if we get it. No, oh, he lowballed me with XP as well. Damn it. What was the other? Find the other. We'll go find the other yo. I thought that the first four or five stages were all like massive amounts of XP. Way more than you should get for what you've done. But like the Biat one is definitely like a daily's reward. But for not nearly as much effort. No, find the one with the okay, upload. <clears throat> the mission's part of Shoal Quick's got to suck. Yeah, some of them do, some of them don't. It's weird. Right, this is kill some things. Hopefully, that will be enough to do it. I want to know more. Do you want to know more? George Glass, welcome to the stream. Nice to see you. Haven't seen you in a little while. How the devil are you? I'll get right on it, he says. Right, okay. So go kill Mossy Girders. I don't think it'll help. I think we're stuck in a... A little bit. Yeah, the green, so doing well. Good. I'm glad to hear it. Nine more mossy girders. It's Sesame Street time, everybody.
If we were killed all of these, <laughs> we've done enough. The other ones have a bit more XP. I can't remember. Certain stages do, certain stages don't. It's, it's that kind of deal, isn't it? I think that was a lag pull. Some of my buffs are actually running out. I have to recast them. <laughs> I'm looking now and going, how long have I got left on me? Still over an hour. What time are we at? It's gone gone nine-ish. And ultimately we want like 124 and then we can get the uh, Corporal Ashley Winstead quest lines done. I probably need some help with the Borg part I think. Four more. I had a fixer ready for that. I, I could use my fruit fixer to, to do all of that and just stay in the arm in the air or something, but we'll see how we go on. I'd be strong enough to think I can do it by uh, 120, I don't know. My shade got help from a speedy fixer. Did I help you with that? Is that what you <laughs> I, I randomly just go off and help people because why not? You know, there's last night someone on Discord. Is anybody able to come and help do the left and right hand in Inferno? And they are pretty tough mobs to kill, actually. Um, and I was like, well, what have you got? Oh, and, no, and I went, you need a dock. So I just, I just came on my dock and we're fine. Did both. Nobody died. And they got them both killed. Kill, uh, killed both the mobs, rather. Okay, is that one left now? One more mossy girder. can help with my trader for the killing part when I'm available since you helped me a lot with part of the DB quest. Yeah, it's no problem. I, I don't do it to get paid back. I, I, I do it to be helpful, that's all. There's a lot of players like me in the game that are, you know, quite happy just to help someone out. All right, we hand this in, we hit 110, and then hopefully we can get a mission from the Forester. This is the cunning plan, only it's taken about 45 minutes to get to the point where we can talk to, to get to 110. Much longer than I thought. I thought, oh yeah, these couple of missions will do it. Nope. Yay, there we go. 110, can't have totemic rights till 120. Can't do acrobat 4 till 140. Is it time to start thinking about careful in battle? I usually have this maxed on a shade um, because you just become nearly impossible to hit. Or should we go piercing mastery? I'm going to go careful in battle, you know. Because you do get that emergency no thing straight away, even though you're only getting 20 add all day. Okay, listen to the story. I won't be doing the rest of these quests. 
uh, tonight at least. The Zombies game, diddly 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 diddly. The dialogue. Come on. <laughs> Skip. Skip the dialogue. Some of these yo's, if you don't listen to the, the long form uh, story that they tell you, you don't get uh, the next quest. They go, okay, goodbye then. <laughs> Just leave you hanging. You're like, oh, did not want to do that. They love the talking a lot. I know they're like the the uh, what are the trees called in the tw two towers. Yeah, like them <laughs> or Parthenax. Oh, let me talk to you slowly and repeat many words in dragon tongue. But no, just let's go. I have nothing to tell you. Okay, so one ten is he just not the right guy then? He, he's still not going to talk to me. I think the guy down here is just for the quest, isn't he? <laughs> you point, I'll shoot. I have nothing to tell you. I know all these ones are vendors, aren't they? God damn it. Yeah, all matters of yada yada yada, yeah. You do not have the key to this garden. I will not speak to you. So are we to assume that there's no um mission giver in sheol or we've got the levels wrong and it's not 110 it's higher what can you tell me of this garden what's this but this one will talk to you and hear how your day has been hang on, hang on, hang on. Happy to see you, cat. <laughs> How was this garden created? Yada, yada, yada. What do you do here? Yeah, she was. We used to have um, our daughter's dog uh, when she got a bit too much around small, um, I mean, like, you know, weak old babies. They got a bit worried. Um, so we we took her in she'd lived with us before anyway so it was fine um but my god she was vocal like you me coming downstairs with a plate you like chewbacca half the time i'm sure that she had some sort of husky in her somewhere she was right hinds 57 kind of breed you know you, you got a face like a corgi but about the size of a small um german shepherd and <laughs> No, none of her legs were the same length, and actually a lovely old dog. She she looked for all the world like a giant corgi that had grown long legs or something. It was, you know, we reckon she was part corgi, maybe part um, Alsatian or something like that. We didn't know the original owners, so we didn't actually know. Yeah, she was a lovely dog. It was a shame. She got she had like a couple of strokes and the vet said that it's just gonna get worse and worse, you know, what do you wanna do? And we were like kindest thing, you know. It is sad and you feel horrible and cruel, but you know, when there's nothing more you can do for them, there's nothing more you can do for them. 
Right, so I'm bang out of luck getting this <laughs> this to work. Nobody in here. Well, I need that cat in this garden right now. There's nothing in here wants to talk to me. Another one from Siljar Russell. Let's have a look. Hiss. Yep, I like it. It's quite funny. Not a big, massive fan of Kiss. They've got some great shoot, uh, songs and stuff. Um, some questionable personalities in that group, but, uh, you know, what the hell. Hello. You have a talk bubble. But he has nothing to tell me. Right, they all hate me in Sheol. So we're gonna give we're gonna give Sheol a miss. So you got Forrester here. He won't talk. I have nothing to tell you. Uh. Never mind. Right, we're up on three hours now, so I think it's time to do a draw, maybe. Yeah, they um, they, they did. Um, they've got a load of great songs, you know, but they behave like it's Monday in that garden. <laughs> yeah. They're very distinctive, obviously, with the, the makeup. I mean, I think that was the idea, you know, to make themselves stand out. I mean, they've got some pleasant rock, you know, melodic rock songs and stuff like that. Um, never rated Ace Freely as, as a... People, oh, Ace Freely's an amazing guitar player. No, no, he's not. He's, he's, he's distinctive. He is distinctive, but... But an amazing guitar, no. Unless he, unless he's the one that wrote all those tracks, I don't know. I always thought it was um, the very big guy and the um, the other guitar player that did most of the songwriting. I don't know. They went off and did stuff on their own, um, and he wrote a load of songs that were good. So I don't know. I'm not a Kiss fan. I remember I had friends who were. Thought they were amazing. I was like, I don't dislike them, but I prefer Iron Maiden, you know. Eh, we all like different things and that's fine. Right, we are going to go and do the do. Right, the command is, I think, uh, give away... Draw. No way! Mahalik was drawn from the giveaway twice in one go. Really? <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Um, it is what it is. That is awesome. Look, mind you, how many were in? It was only. Like ten, I think. Yeah, there were twelve entries, so it was twelve to one. And I think last time it was only eight to one, so it wasn't massive, massive odds. Uh but yeah. <laughs> Gonna swap a grace back and forward at this rate. I know. I think yeah. Okay, Mihaly. <laughs> <laughs> but um we spoke about this when you borrowed one from me didn't we um i can't believe that but it's mubot i i can't change how it does anything so um where have you gone on the discord there you are Pope, wake up, come and do this. Loot's dropped. Oi, come here. Right, do you remember um, when we spoke about it last time and you told me the exact character and the exact by order value? Uh, 
on the Discord. If you do the same again, I will sell you the grace the same way. This is how I can give it to you. You uh, didn't know it. I rigged Moobot, the, the, the same bot that everybody else uses. <laughs> yeah, I know. Cats. Yeah, we should probably add... I need to add a load more stuff to Moobot. Oh, the command you didn't know. Oh, I'm sorry, Randy, R R Rango. Yeah, we, we did the thing at the beginning of the stream and then told everybody what to type as more people came in, like after one hour, then two hours, and, and then said, right, now we're going to draw. So sorry about that. Next time, dude. Next time. I'm trying to think now. No, they're not on this turn. <laughs> derp, 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 derp. Daylights, I'm going to down some more Nikwa. Is that the same as Night Nurse? Like, got opiate in it and whatnot. It knocks you out anyway. <laughs> Sleep on your side. Recovery position when you go to bed with that. We're giving away, uh, Randy, we're giving uh, one away every week. So we've got every chance of winning one next week. I don't give them away on really, really busy streams like the Saturday with the Aliens event because um, obviously you, there's so many more people on the stream that probably only turn up because they want to know where to go for the Alien event, uh, which is fine. I'm, I'm cool with that, but I'd rather give them away to people that come on most of the streams so we do them on quieter evenings so yeah let's have a look on the discord okay so you, you're buying it on that too God, 97, 98 billion. I think I can see you waving. Okay. Can't see your order at the moment, though. Give it a minute to show. Oh, have you not actually made the order yet? <laughs> uh, you won't be able to do it, uh, Randy. It's not a code, it's an in-game grace. So you would need a paid account in order to um, access the grace. Because you can't, you can't buy things on GMI. I didn't know. Okay. Alexander, five thousand and six hundred and seventy-eight credits. Sell. Oof! There you go. One grace is given away. Even though the highest buy orders are all 98 billion. Wow. There we go. That's one grace. Yeah. If you're a froob, you can browse GMI, but you just can't buy and sell on GMI. So there's an AO streamer where you can look up location and that's when they decided to stick with the stream. 
Okay. I just put Britain. <laughs> General area. Yeah. Kind of thing. Right, well, thank you all very much for coming along for tonight's stream. A pleasure, as always. And uh, I will be back tomorrow. Um, it's not an Aliens uh, night tomorrow, though. It's the next Aliens is... I remember correctly is the 16th we had one on the second so the next one is the 16th not the 16th 17th i think let me double check i'm not getting that wrong because people do show up on saturday and go is it aliens is it aliens <laughs> i'm like well no <laughs> as far as i know event call out when was the last one It was on the third, right? So the next one, yeah, is going to be on the seventeenth. Yeah, if you've got a Froob account, no, and you, if you go, if you, if you have a Froob account, and you make it a paid account, it stays as a paid account forever. Uh, Randy Rango. No, there's no kind of rolling back to Froob. It's never been a thing. I think it was too difficult for them to implement. Because you think about it, if you were 220 on that account and then you um, went, oh, I'm not going to pay, I'll just go back to Froob, then all of the gear you were wearing would be, like, it all have to become ineffective and you would have to be de-leveled by... 20 shadow levels plus all the AI. I, I think it, mechanically they just probably couldn't do it. Um, whereas newer games, they probably build that in. Free account and upgrade that's, you know, that can roll back and forth. But AO was never ever made that way. So I don't think that, you know, mechanically they couldn't do it, maybe. Uh, it might be possible. I don't know. But I think it's pretty unlikely we will ever see that now at this stage. ICC planet-wide announcement. Bunny has been awarded the highest honorary rank for outstanding dedication to the defense of Rubicar. <laughs> is a clip of my suicide from last week. Yeah, that's pretty funny. It's like a Naratu run into the death fence. Yeah, it's quite funny. Right, thank you all. Is anybody else streaming a bit of anarchy? Shall we have a look? Do another raid. I like raiding people. It's quite fun. As long as they're okay with it. You know. I did raid someone once and it was like, oops. <laughs> so I freaked them out and I was like, oh God, I'm so sorry. Um, but you can disable allowing channels to raid you, so I don't know. We're going to go raid Mr. Nave Zero. He's over there streaming away. I don't know if he's got music on. Nope. I don't know if he's talking Thanks or what he's doing. Yeah, he is. Yep, yeah, he is. Okay, we're going to go raid Nave. Everyone go say hi. Give him some love, give him some follows, etc. So if you're a subscriber or whatever, it's the top one. And if you're not, it's the bottom one. But if everyone goes, it's all fun. Right then, thank you all. We now raid with the perfect number, 42. Okay, folks, bye for now. <laughs>